Yo, what's going on everybody? It's your boy Boone coming at you guys with a brand new video. In today's video, we are going to be taking a little look at the brand new Supreme Week. I think it's week 9 now. I am excited because again, we have a fire week from Supreme, bro. They be treating us this season to be honest. I know some of you guys might hate this season possibly. Do let me know in the comments if you do or just like your opinion of this season in general. So far, I have been very pleased. This is another week where I'm excited about. We're going to jump in this video in one second. I quickly have to say a couple things though. Like like very very short things first off thank you guys for 21k you guys are the goats like we haven't even done our 20k sub giveaway yet that's coming up this week also my little like cleaning video for how to clean up your nasty sweaty musty ass clothes is coming this week so if you want to watch that video drop a subscription for me please I'd appreciate it also do drop a like while you're hovering around that button and let's jump in this video I hope you all enjoy so I did record this entire video to be honest and I hate to say it but I wasn't even screen recording the whole time so I do hate myself right now but like what else is new? Let's get in this list, baby. Um, it's listed from the most hyped, most popular items to the least hyped items. Starting it off, we got these leather ID holders slash wallets, and these are gonna pop off in my opinion, and I think that just because um, they are red and camo, which are like the two hype beasts, like national flag colors. I think resale on these really does depend on what retail is gonna be. Like, if we're gonna get some fake imitation leather, it'll be very cheap, like 30 to 40 bucks, hopefully. But if we get some real, like, nice ass leather ID holders, it could be upwards of like over 80 to 100 bucks probably so hopefully these aren't too expensive we will see good resale if they aren't i might go for one i probably will to be honest i kind of like them um let me know what you guys think of them if you're gonna go for them next up we got these sleeve logo sideline parka and i think these are hot trash I absolutely hate these and I will tell you why in a second. First off, I just gotta roast this terrible McDonald's like manager colorway. Like that shit just be looking garbage. Um, I kind of think like the teal's cool. One of my issues with these is like they're parkas, so they're just humongous, like snuggy type jackets that just take up your entire damn body. I'm used to parkas not being that loud of items. Like usually you see parkas and they're kind of just very basic things since maybe because they're so big, but um, these just have these horrendously huge supreme spell outs, and some of you are probably like, bro, that shit's five, fuck you mean. But but that shit just looks trash in my opinion like it's just so loud and obnoxious I don't love any of the colorways this teal if it was like a regular jacket I think would be cool I think I'd like all these more if they're regular jackets except for this red like no matter what this shit is trash but these two are like decent I guess the teal is kind of cool if like it wasn't a parka but um, I'm gonna be missing all these these are probably not gonna resell uh, next up we got the supreme tag air pocket pro watch, stopwatch I'm probably saying this shit wrong I don't know bro your boy got no bust downs or nothing on here so I don't have to know about these watch brands I believe that's a watch brand um, and basically this stopwatch is gonna be a shitload of money So if you're down to time yourself on like how quickly you can spend a shitload of money um, This is the perfect item for you because it's gonna be like two to three hundred dollars what I've heard Just because it is a very expensive watch company So they're like fuck it. Let's drop this check and make this stopwatch and I am not gonna buy this um, This stopwatch is for people like that also went and bought that chair I feel like so enjoy your like inflatable chair and little stopwatch that you dropped like 500 bucks on I'm not about this. I don't think it's gonna resell I'm not into it let's keep going maybe the lanyard will resell who knows next up we have this supreme the killer trustee this is gonna be the new collaboration for this week um, and basically I want a supreme community I was too lazy to do my own research fuck that and we found out the killers a 1989 action film it was based in China um, honestly it looks like a cool movie I've never seen it before but it seemed kind of interesting I might watch it who knows I probably have to if I buy this shit um, but we got the supreme killer trustee I think this is such a sick design I absolutely love it this is what manual boys be looking like when they're looking at each other talking about bots you can't trust nobody in manual gang um, I know I'm not even really manual gang anymore so I can't talk but I'm just trying to make jokes all right this would it be like when you see another person trying to check out with your item at like the supreme checkout it really be like that can't trust anyone in this profession so I do think this is a fire ass shirt we got two homies just with guns to each other's heads this collaboration reminds me a lot of the supreme kids collab that's probably because of like the little text on the back also like the themes and the images are kind of violent and just like guns and like dope shit so I don't know Reminds me somewhat of the kids supreme collab. I love this so much though I think this is a dope shirt. I might go get one for the personal even who knows um, next up We got the supreme champion 3d metallic just butthole garbage This is just not the one for me like I think this just looks so bad Maybe if there was like a bottle opener it'd be kind of cool like I don't know bro um, This whole like 3d metallic look is so garbage. They need to stop it with all these metals We had like a liquid tea We had that horrible silver TNF supreme parka like all the like weird metal liquidy shit just needs to stop just chill out for a second supreme this looks like garbage in my opinion the supreme champion collabs and been kind of like uh, like they've not really been killing it recently they definitely did not kill it on this one i hate all of these i just think it's such a bad design um next up we got the dragon rayon shirt and this is definitely 
like my least favorite item of all the dragon items we've seen drop this season. Uh, retail hopefully won't be too much money, but I don't see these really reselling. Maybe like Japan could like have these pop off. I doubt it. I probably wouldn't go for these for resale or nothing. Even the Supreme Killer Trust Tee, I wouldn't go for that for resale either. We're starting to see so many Supreme Tees just bomb nowadays. And since it's also a collab, it's gonna be $10 extra. I don't think it's worth resale. Uh, next up we got the Supreme Killer Hooded Sweatshirt. And I just love this hoodie, bro. Like this black colorway. Low key might even resell because it's so gas. We have the black and white little graphic with the red outlines. Like it just pops so nicely. Red on black always looks great. On the back the same in our profession. We don't trust anybody. Um, I think this is a super sick hoodie. You got some like little homie just wrecking some chick's life on the front. Um, I just think it's such a dope ass graphic. I love this hoodie. I could see myself grabbing one, but you already know them Supreme Retails be getting so stupid, bro. Like I doubt I'll buy one. I gotta conserve my money, so we can't be looking at that too much. It is fire though. I fully condone the purchase of this hoodie. If you go out and buy one, like ups to you. This shit is hard as hell. I would not buy it just because retail is gonna be so much damn money. Supreme just be jugging out here. Uh, next we got the fleece pole cord camp cap and these are actually kind of clean. I cannot lie, especially this tan color. I love the tan. Um, the red on navy might actually do well because you know, got the little red box logo Bogo Boys pulling up on this one, but I don't really like the rest of the colorway. Next up we got the Supreme Killer Skateboard and this is my favorite item of the entire collaboration, just the entire week. I think this is such a fire skate deck. I need one of these. I really want to put one up in my room. Uh, I usually don't care about skate decks like for actually keeping them, but I would straight up keep this for just like displaying when I got my own place. Super interesting graphic. Again, we got the two homies not trusting each other. I just love this graphic. It reminds me a lot, like I said, of like something out of like Scarface or the Kid Supreme collab, like I already said. I think it's this dope ass deck. Um, it's so weird to see like a graphic like this hugely on the top of the deck. You never really see that. It's usually like a Supreme spell out or maybe like the movie's name. Don't really see graphics like that. So that's a dope ass skate deck. I'm probably gonna go for that. Let me know if you want me to go for anything else though. Next up we got the Supreme Killer long sleeve tee and I don't like this very much because um, I don't know, it doesn't even look like a Supreme design. It looks like they just printed this like from some Google image, which I guess is actually exactly what Supreme does like every collab. So this looks exactly like a Supreme collab. It's not for me though. Um, I'm not that crazy about this one. I just, I don't know. I don't really like like other languages text on my shirts because I usually don't know what it means. I feel kind of stupid with it unless it's the Arabic logo. That's like my only exception next up We got the killer m65 jacket. This is pretty clean. I have to say retail is gonna be a lot of money though So it's probably not worth it I do like the graphic and I think it's a cool shirt But or a jacket I should say but I wouldn't buy it So I don't blame you if you don't buy it, but I don't know like it's kind of cool um, Next up we got a little box logo sticker. I'm excited to see that hopefully 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 it is this graphic and not something stupid like this um, Next up striped rib logo long sleeve top. This shit is so ugly Ugly, bro like I just absolutely hate this I don't like this design at all um, not for me so I don't want to talk about it it's not gonna resell next up we got the thorn trucker jacket these are gas bro like I'm low-key kind of beefing they didn't put this on the TNFs because I think this would have been such a sick all-over print on the TNF jackets um, I've never really seen like a thorn print like this let me know if you guys have maybe that's a thing in fashion I've just never seen it um, so I like this like an original all-over pattern I think it looks great the idea of like having thorns like covering over your body like you're some rose shout my dude Yusuf. I think this is a cool ass jacket. I probably wouldn't buy it for the personal but I don't blame you if you do. Um, damn bro this would have been so hard on some TNF shit. I would have loved that. Very cool design. You killed it on that one Supreme. I don't know why it's getting so much hate. Uh, we got the leopard panel half zip sweatshirts and these are so damn ugly. They're almost fire. That's like how I usually feel with leopard print. Like it's just so like just ridiculous that when you wear it you cannot be taken seriously. So if some like rapper pulled up with this shit i would think it's hella hard but otherwise i think this shit's corny um supreme is doing their thing though just putting weird ass like patterns and shit on normal ass like half zips that's some supreme type shit to do so that's kind of like an interesting jacket i guess next up we got the supreme world headquarters shirts and i kind of think these are dope like i'm not gonna lie um the red and black colors i actually really like that's probably just me liking striped t-shirts if it said like supreme world famous on it that'd be way cooler in my opinion or if it said like like and subscribe i'd rock with that a lot more <laughs> yeah you dig um, but these are not that fire in my opinion like for resale or nothing maybe for the personal these could possibly like somehow pop off like for resale like maybe nah it's not gonna happen though nah I doubt it next up we got supreme champion beanies these are just even 
worse than the long sleeves, bro. They're just like, how can we make it even uglier? And they were like, fuck it, let's put it on a beanie. This shit's gonna weigh your head down. Like, it's gonna be some heavy ass 3D, like metallic bullshit. Like, I hope somebody gets hit by some shit and that metal just ingrains that champion logo into your damn skull for buying this dumbass beanie. Uh, I'm sorry, I'm kind of getting violent. It's looking at all this like violent gun shit in this drop. I don't know, my bad. Let's keep going. We got the classic little titty beanies. These are ugly as hell. I hate these so much, bro. Please don't buy these. Those, like, every color is so loud, too. Like, what the fuck? Um, Thorn Camp Cap, this is kind of clean. I'm not going to front. I like this, but I'm sure you guys hate it. Like, it looks like it's getting some hate. I think it's a cool pattern. Um, Stripe 6 panel. Now, these are fucking ugly as hell. So bad. Thorn 5 pocket jeans. I wish they had put this on a TNF. Like, these are cool, I guess, but I would not buy them. It's going to be too much money. I like the pattern, though. Um, I wish there was more colors as well, like a purple, like on a jacket. It would look so fire, but it's been your boy, Boone. That's the whole drop list. We recorded this video twice, so you got to smash that like button three times. Um, yeah, I don't know. It's been your boy, Boone. I hope you guys enjoyed the video. 20K sub giveaway coming soon, even though we're at 21K now. Like, you guys are crazy. Thank you all for the support. Back on these daily uploads. See how Select's got to drop on Saturday. Low key, that's why I didn't make a video yesterday. I was very busy shipping stuff out for all my customers. Shout out to you guys. Um, I love you all for supporting me as always. If you watch this video all the way through, I don't know what's wrong with you. You must have nothing better to do with your life than watch this shitty outro. All right, I'm going to cut this one off. It's been your boy, Boone. I'm out. Peace.